Saturday Night Live notched its highest rating in six years thanks to the return of Melissa. McCarthy's White House press secretary Sean Spicer and Alec Baldwin's record 17th outing as host. NBC's late night mainstay grabbed a 7.2 household rating and 18 share in Nielsen's 56 overnight. Metered markets, which cover about 70% of US TV households, that marked the show's highest mark in the overnight since the Jan. 8, 2011, edition hosted by Jim Carrey, which was boosted to a 7.8 household rating in part by an NFL overrun in adults 18 to 49. Saturday's SNL scored a 3.6 rating strong enough to beat the overnight demo scores of all primetime programs last week that stat may change when delayed viewing is factored in. The latest numbers which will grow with delayed viewing factored in will bolster SNL's already strong performance in the Trump era. Viewership of the show for the season to date is up 22% in total viewers 10.6 million and 19%. In adults 18 to 49, 3.5 compared to the same period last season. That makes it the most watched SNL season in 22 years since the 1994-95 frame. President Trump continues to provide a wealth of material for the SNL team. McCarthy's second time at a Spicer generated a tidal wave of social media buzz. SNL trooper Kate McKinnon was the night's MVP, appearing as presidential advisor Kellyanne Conway. Attorney General Jeff Sessions and Democratic Senator Elizabeth Warren, all in Trump-related sketches.